hello and welcome to what remains of Edith Finch. Somehow I thought this was a horror game. Turns out it's not a horror game. It's a horribly sad game. Who's ready to cry? Not me. I'm going in blind. I have no idea what this game is. We have a broken arm? Oh no, and I don't see any names on it. No one wrote on our cast? That's how you can see if someone is very lonely and sad indeed. Oh. Okay. Start at the beginning with the house. A house. Okay, thanks. Oh, we can walk. Oh, there's like a gate here. Always check behind you guys. Someone had put up a chain link fence, but it looked like I wasn't the first person to hop it. Oh, we hopped the fence. Is that how we broke our arm? Can we jump? We can't jump in this game. Phew, I'm no longer scared. Now I'm just sad. Most missing. My brother Milton disappeared when I was four. Oh it no. It was like the house just swallowed him up. Wait, like... He got missing inside the house? If you have information about Milton, call the... Orca's Island Police? Orca Island, that sounds pretty cool. Milton Finch, date missing October 23rd, 2023. Date of birth, uh, 1992. So he was 8 plus 3, carried 1, 11. Oh, age of disappearance, it says right there. Thanks. <laughs> um, so he was 11, went to play hide and seek and just never returned? I, d I, d I have no idea. Sure, sure, sure. Coraline? Uh, okay. We're walking, we're walking. Can we sprint? I lived here until I was 11, but I wasn't allowed inside half the rooms. Uh, wait, right there? Is that a house? <laughs> this is giving a series of unfortunate events. And I'm concerned. A child lived there? Are we sure that Milton is not just stuck inside the walls? Wait, what is this? Ooh, it's so cute. Is this our mailbox? Inside the mailbox were bills from seven years ago. Marked urgent. Open immediately. <laughs> Open immediately. Not really. Sorry, man. Let go. Thank you. Um. Mm -hmm. No trespassing. My brother Lewis's funeral. Wait, wait, wait. So, brother Milton disappeared. Brother Lewis dead. R.I.P. Lewis? Just open. <gasps> oh my gosh, look, these are so pretty. Is this Yay, it's Fox Gloves. Can we can we It's Fox Gloves. They're so cute. I love these so much. They they're one of my favorites. We used to have these in the backyard when I was young. Um not touching though, very, very poisonous. <laughs> you don't want dolls, but they're very, very pretty. They smell nice. Um no trespassing. Video survey. Should we close the gate? Can we close the gate? We cannot, in fact, close the gate. <laughs> Not powerful enough. Brother Lewis is dead. Oh, <gasps> fox will, gloves! Indeed. My mother left me a key, but didn't tell me what it unlocked. Uh, okay, we have a key. I like how Maybe we just. She thought I'd know, or she thought the mystery would be enough to bring me back. Where do we go? Do we go down here or over there? I kind of want to go here, but I've, where, where do we go? The finches. We go not. We go down. Ah. Uh. <laughs> okay. So apparently, chat is doing a thing where they hydrate. Like you should take a shot of water every time I do something. They have a bingo, but I don't know what the bingo. Are we supposed to go here? I feel like we're gonna get lost. I'm already lost. This is a terrible idea. So I don't know the rules. Uh, Cause they have the rules in the discord. Um, the game is protecting me from myself. I can only go certain the ways. Truth is, even after I inherited the house, I never thought I'd come back to it. Uh, screw the house, right? I had questions about my family that only the house knew the answers to. A uh, question, is she loud enough? Can you guys hear her? Cause sometimes she's very quiet, little Edith. Um, I'm already getting the lost. The woods around the house have always been uncomfortably silent. 
as if they're about to say something but never do. Oh, really? We have nice ambiance. So much foxglove. What lives in these woods? To be fair, we had a bunny and I just never touched it. Da -da -da -da. Oh no! No, Mil oh, what do we have on our necklace? Is that a ring? It's something. Okay, that's probably gonna be important later on. <gasps> Mini house checkpoint. We shall hydrate. Are you guys making me hydrate whenever you have to hydrate? <laughs> I'm gonna run out of tea. Let's play some hoops. Uh, hello. Uh, please don't have like a body inside or something. Okay, cool. We could have just gone there, but that would have been less adventurous. The house was exactly Ooh. like I remembered it. The way I'd been dreaming about it. Okay. Is that, that- that kind of looks like a fish coming out of the... How many missing posters are there on their own property? Are you guys making me hydrate whenever you need to hydrate? I'm gonna be so paranoid about any and everything I do that's gonna trigger me having to drink. <laughs> do we go around or do we go up? Screw we go up. So pretty. Why is As there a child, so much fox glove? The house made me uncomfortable in a way I couldn't put into words. Uh, I would constantly be fearing for my sudden death. How is that for words? It looks cool. But also... Why? <laughs> it is very cute and colorful though. But that's that's just begging to like come down. Wh who who gave them the permission to do the what is that in a tree? It's Yeah. I don't think this is uh this is legal now, to build like that. As a 17-year-old, I knew exactly what those words were. I was afraid of the house. What the house do? What did the house do? Okay, here we go. Uh, <laughs> Weasley's house, yes. Mm, hello. Potting mix. I like how even if we went here, we would have had the exact same thing. But it's giving me a little bit of FOMO, you know? Key! I hope the key might unlock the front door. Probably not. It didn't. So we gotta kick the door down. Move back, everybody. Oh, no. Looking in, I felt like the house itself had been waiting for me. As opposed to what? It wandered off? Alright. So, alternate route. Garage. <laughs> I was so ready to kick it down, man. That's sad. Hello? Knock, knock. No. Chimes. It's okay, we'll just go through here. Through the little kitty door. Doggy door. That's exactly what we're gonna do. <laughs> Crawling through the doggy door used to be a lot easier when I was 11. This is so not... burglary proof. But it's okay because they had a no trespassing sign. No one's allowed to go through. The power had been turned off the night we left. I like how she didn't just flip it on and off, but it went like... That's, that's how everyone would react, you know. The night we left? Plural? Okay. Um, cleaning products. For when inevitably some other accident happened and I had to clean up the blood. Tennis ball. Bikes. Where do we go? That way. All right. Hi, Kenneke. For the first time in years. Finish your sentence. Don't be shy. I felt like I was home. Aww. Is she still scared of the home or is it okay now? I don't know. Where to begin? <laughs> the table was still a wreck from the night we left. What happened on the night you left, girl? It was like a bomb had gone off. Killing everyone but sparing the furniture. I, I, I wouldn't call this sparing the furniture, but okay. 
Wait, what do you mean killing everyone? Eddie? Who is e Wait, who is Eddie? Is there like an elderly person involved? Oh no. Who's My mom this? was the only one of us who could imagine great grandma Edie living in a nursing home. Edie. <laughs> Okay, so Edie should have been safe and sound in a nursing home, but uh, R.I.P. Instead, we are here. What am I doing that's making... <laughs> okay, apparently we have hydration, bingo. Nothing in the house looked abnormal. There was just too much of it, like a smile with too many teeth. Yeah, no, that's, that's uh, uncanny. <laughs> Guess? Oh my Even God. the fireplace had a story. Edie told me the bricks came from the original house oh. after it sank. Uh, it sank? How does a house sink? Uh, th th where's the text going? <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Take me with you. Let me be free. How do we crouch? I can't get in there. Mechanical asphyxiation. Fun. <laughs> Haley Speedread, thank you so much, Jess, for gifting a sub to Haley. I appreciate you. <gasps> Kelly! Oh my gosh, wait, hold on. Break, break, break. We are officially at 6k follows. Kelly, you were number 6,000, which is pretty cool. Okay, celebration apart. Oh my gosh, there's a pedal. So there was like a boat wreckage thing outside. The chimney, apparently, like the house sank. We have a pedal. There's is this like a fisherman's house? Oh, could be. Um Oh my god, it's bugs. Oh, they're so cool. I don't particularly like this centipede, but the rest of it is pretty dope. Oh, is that a crab? Or is it a flying bug? Like a beetle thing? I don't know. It's cool though. That one's dope. Boat. <laughs> oh, oh. Barbara? Click it. <gasps> it's a music box. I swear if it jumps out. Ooh. Great Grandpa Sven built a music box for Barbara. Along Who's with the rest Barbara? of the house. He built this for her? He, did, he didn't do a great job. <gasps> She's a movie director? Or an actress? I don't know, but I love it. <laughs> Again? Stop. We go in here. Mom though. always told me to stay out of the basement, so key? I wasn't too surprised when the key didn't fit. We can't kick down the doors. It's our house. She's like, oh, it will be so easy. You know, fun fact I can actually pick locks as long as they're not too difficult. I have a lock picking set and I have a bunch of practice locks. I could potentially. Pick this. Given enough time, I could pick it, I think. It's a bit old, though. I swear I'm gonna disable the hydration. But. We'll move on. We'll get back to that. <gasps> Can we use this thing? Can we use Grandma Edie's... Well, no. <sighs> we have to walk. Sure, fine. After Milton disappeared, Mom sealed right. up all the bedrooms. All then Edie retaliated and drilled peepholes. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Okay, hold on. So much wild stuff is happening. From sealing all the bedrooms to drilling peepholes. Like, I get it, you're a grandma, but Bigfoot? Oh, Barbara was an actress then. Whenever people ask me about uh. my family, the first thing they always want to know about is Barbara. Fair enough. Now showing... We can Bigfoot. Oh, we can go higher up. What, what is this cable? Where, where is that cable? Barbara? Beephole. Barbara was a child star for two years. Until America grew out oh. of it. Oh, she was a child. That's pretty cool. Uh-huh. I want to know where this cable leads. Mom Please must let have me locked through. the third floor stairs on the night we left. What is this mom's problem? Locking literally everything. I just want to get through. Leaving me a house of secrets. But no way to get to them. I want to know. Mother. Mother knows best. Yeah, yeah, I get it. Oh. 
Sven and Eddie. How many kids are there? We have Milton, Sven. Wait, Sven and Edie. Oh, wait, are these the grandpa and grandma? So we have Barbara, Milton. Was it Lucas or something? Like the guy that d died? The guy, kid? Sven, Hofstadt, Finch, and Edie. Just Edie. Screw Edie and her last names. Oh, but he died so soon. The last time I was in Edith Sr.'s room, I was 10 and she was painting my portrait. Do we have the portrait? <gasps> oh, you get your purple dress, can you get <laughs> We will match, that would be fun. Calvin and Sam, who, who, are, who are they? Calvin died, but Sam didn't? I. Why is there a peephole with their name engraved in it, in like the day of their death? That's kind of morbid. 64. 61. Who is this? Gregory? How many people lived in this house and why are they all dead? Lewis. There we are. I thought it was like a Lucas. My grandpa Sam spent seven years sharing a room with his dead brother, Calvin. Wait, what? Not literally, right? Matt, thank you so much for subscribing for four months in a row. I appreciate it. You as well. Thank you so much for your support. I have a question though, Matt. Do you think like they meant it metaphorically as in they left the room? I love the divider rope. <laughs> like, my space? Do not cross. <laughs> Hi, Lids. Uh, okay. Okay, so now what? Now what? Did we go back down? I think we've seen... Oh! Well, this, this is an interesting door. Oh, I like the door design. <gasps> You're very pretty. I spent Excuse a lot me. of time playing in Great Uncle Walter's room. Great Uncle Walter had no stuff? Uh, what is this? Lewis told me there were secret passages, but I never believed him. Secret passages like underwater? 249. Um, oh, it's like a train cart? Jess, thank you so much for gifting us up to... I still don't know how to pronounce. <laughs> yeah, the stroke is very pretty. Ritage? Ritai? <laughs> Welcome to the sub squad, love. <gasps> Wait, why does the mom have the key? Turns out, my mom was really good at keeping secrets. <gasps> oh! Oh! Now it was time to find oh. out what my mom had been afraid of. Ayo, <laughs> ayo, what? We're we're going into the. Wait, no one questioned why there was more spit. Well, uh, bugs. Wait, hold on. Oh, they're cool. Okay, no, no, I'm getting sidetracked. I'm getting sidetracked. Wh how? Why is this here? How <laughs> are we gonna crawl through this? The doggy door was already annoying. Now this. Oh. This is very cool. Drawings? There was a child here? It's Milton. From the paintings on the wall, it was clear my <gasps> brother Milton had been here before me. It was Milton. Oh my god, I'm clairvoyant. Reading this, maybe it sounds like I had a plan. That's really cool though. Milton is an artist. Milton was 11 and drew that. Milton is more talented than I will ever be. He is a literal child. But I had no idea what was behind that door. Uh, should we be scared? Um, what was the point of this? Just like I had no idea where all this was gonna lead. What? Why? Why did it lock? Why did it close? No, let me out! Let me out! What if we get stuck here? This is so pretty. Is this a whistle? It's an owl whistle. Um, I grew up Molly? looking at Molly's room through the peephole. Why is everyone looking at each other's stuff through peepholes? Why was Milton in Molly's room to get into the thing to their uncle's room? What? There's so many questions in this game. She has a unicorn. 
<gasps> that was one lucky girl. Except for the fact that she probably died, so maybe not as lucky. Okay, okay, okay. There we go. Um, we opened this, I guess. Molly's gerbil had a tiny bedroom with its own even tinier gerbil cage. Oh, that was so cute! Wait, that's it? Gerbil? Um... Hello? Being inside for the first time, I felt like I'd stepped behind a painting. Right, she's seen it. So much time, and then... Jess, thank you so much for gifting us up to star. That's very sweet. I appreciate you. <laughs> Can we find the people? Oh, there it is. Wow, it's like this is a time capsule. Of all these rooms that these dead people have inhibited. Wow, that's really cool, but also kind of morbid. Fox! I like foxes. Mm. I got the oh. sense Edie had spent a lot of time here before my mom sealed the doors. Oh, that's that's very sad. December thirteenth, nineteen forty-seven. Oh, dear diary. I'll be gone soon, what? but I wanted to tell somebody about what's going to happen. It started when Mom sent me to bed without dinner. She knows? I woke up and I was starving, so I looked around for something to eat. Wait, 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 wait. Are we now playing as Molly? What? Uh, she was like, ah, ha, ha, I'm going to die. Did she mean she was going to run away? But she has a gerbil. Gerbil food. The gerbil food was dry, but I didn't mind it. Oh, baby, no. Oh. Wait, what's this mother's problem? In all my time, I've never been sent to bed without dinner. I wasn't a difficult kid, to be fair, but my parents would never send me to bed without dinner. It's the opposite. It would sit me down until I ate all my veggies and stuff. <laughs> Mom, can I come out now? Sweetheart, it's late. Go to sleep. Why does she sound like German or something? <laughs> this poor child didn't have dinner. How could you? Thank you so much just for gifting another sub to Roman. My it's Halloween nice. candy was all gone. No, I don't like this game anymore. It's making me sad already and no one has even died yet. Oh, she has her own bathroom? Luxurious. Well, don't go eating toothpaste. I kept eating and eating. Girl, no. Oh, I don't think this is healthy to eat. Oh no, don't eat the don't eat the berries. I ate a lot of things that night. There's like four left if you want them. Bird? We could eat bird. I feel like that would be better than the Oh, this poor child. Then I heard chirping outside my window. It was oh. a barn swallow going back to her nest. She's so pretty. Don't want to I chase her. I reached out for her. No, 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 don't, don't go, don't go to the bird. Don't go to the bird. I was kidding suddenly, when I said it was food. I was a cat. Oh, uh, what kind of berries did we just eat? <gasps> We're purring. Wait, 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 hold on. We're actually a cat? Is this a fever dream? Uh, Animagus. Hello, bird. Come back. Can I jump? Oh, we have a little bell. Hello, bird. Please stay. You're my only I friend. I tried to be quiet, but the bird was really scared. 
And we have a little bell around our neck, which isn't helping. Hi, bird. Please stay. Is this how we're gonna die? We transformed into a cat and then we fell off the roof? Mom and Dad didn't even look at me. Screw them. Especially Mom. It's late to go to bed. Piss off. Feed your children. Oh, it's so cute. Hi, birdie. Come back. What if this bird is here to take us to the afterlife? It's the I jumped Reaper. and I almost got her. We're actually trying to eat the bird? Wait, no, I didn't mean to. I could tell she was getting really tired. <laughs> We're actually trying to eat now the bird? Now I was up in the big tree. I oh. promised Dad I wouldn't climb it anymore. All I cared about was eating that mama bird. Eating the mama bird? I gobbled bird. her up. <laughs> and suddenly, I was an owl. First, all I heard was the wind. Then I heard little teeth nibbling in the grass. Oh, where's the mouse? Hello? I did, we definitely... Rabbits. We definitely ate some weird berries there. Oh, hello, rabbits. Please let me, let me catch you, because this girl... This feels very, uh, a little Nightmares-esque. More rabbits! Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, this is how we... Ooh! Um... I imagined his face looking up and seeing mine through my talons. I swallowed him up, could. and I didn't chew one bit. <laughs> then I flew off to find something bigger. Is she good? Oh my god. This is not what she meant when she was like, Oh, I'm gonna be gone soon. She was not like, I'm gonna be a cat. <laughs> Jesus Christ. A mama rabbit. No, no, stop with the mamas. Why, why is it always mamas? She was almost too big to carry. I started choking, but I couldn't stop eating. No. And suddenly, I was a shark. A shark in a tree. Oh no, Sharknado! Hello? We're a dead shark. <laughs> oh my god, what is this game? I thought we were gonna cry, but up until now we've I been murdering bunnies. I rolled off the cliff and into the ocean. Now, I was hungrier than ever. Oh, fish. Is it a mama fish? This girl has some unresolved traumas, man. Where? I wanted fat, juicy seals. It's a seal? I oh! tore off her flipper and it tasted really good. Oh! We didn't even kill it. We tore off a flipper. What the heck? Um. Oh no! Oh no! It's dying! It's my fault! Wait, hold on. Where? Where? Where did it go? Where did it go? I'm confused about the steering system of this game. I grabbed on tight. Oh. But I was so hungry, I jumped out of the water. Are when I opened my eyes, everything had changed. The Fire Nation attacked. What had changed? Uh, I've seen enough hentai to know where that was going. Oh my god, are we like an octopus? Are we Cthulhu? Now I was a monster and I smelled people everywhere. Uh, <laughs> okay, girl. Sure. Sure. What kind of monster moves like this? I am mildly concerned. We can smell the people. I was big, but I moved real quiet. 
careful people we're coming for oh no oh no that's one down okay sure how many more to go what is this I wanted to stop but also I didn't I wanted to stop but ahaha <laughs> Jess, thank you so much for gifting another sub to each other. I really appreciate the support. And each other. Enjoy the subs club. Um, he's here. Nothing apparently. Okay, I think he's gonna be over there. In, in the cabin thing. What should we do? We did all the things. Sailor, eat him up for a monster's breakfast. Oh, we need to go out. I, no, I, I think we want tentacles back. We'll go with that. Oh, oh, there's another person. <laughs> I did not see you at first. Um, I am so sorry. I love how these people, they're like, I left for a minute. What the heck is happening? I don't know. We're a monster and we're eating people. It's concerning, to say the least. Like, mildly concerning is... Not even uh. Hi buddy. I'm so sorry about this, but you're gonna have to and after the last passenger, I was still hungry. And across the water we smelled something new. How much something do you I had to have? have? So I swam towards it. I swear it it she still has my sympathy because she's about to die apparently. But um I slithered onto the sand and the good yeah. smell went into an old pipe. Wow. Slitter. Alright. We're in this pipe. Cause she smelled something. Where are we going with this? Oh my god. Oh, that's the toilet. That's how toilets work, definitely. Ew. Okay, okay. I got closer and closer. Wait, this is our Oh no. Oh no. Liz, I think you're right. What if it is the mom? All of my stomach started growling. Girl. What? Hello? And suddenly, I was me again. I held my breath for a long time, but I couldn't hear anything. I think it's waiting for me to fall asleep. But it's not going to wait much longer. It needs to be, and we both know. I will be delicious. What? Is she okay? Molly, you should be a writer. I'm not sure if I believed all of that, but I'm sure Edie would have. What the heck? <laughs> Wait, I am so confused. Okay, so Molly, you can't see it because it's um underneath my. Ooh, there we go. There we go. I just I don't want to close the thing. Okay, so it says the date of birth and death. So Molly was ten years old when she died. Can't quite understand how. I'm I'm gonna assume it was the berries. <laughs> Jesus. So um, Edie is Edith's. Uh, something. Jesus. Alright, so Edie it was born in 1917 and then she had is it her kids? I don't even or is it Sam's kids? Basically, Molly was born in 1937 and died in 1947. Edith was born in 1999. Is Edith the only one still alive? We don't know about Sanjay, K, and Ingborg, and Sven. Everyone else on here is dead. That's a lot of people, actually. Oh God. Wait, 1937. Odin died the year Molly was born. Okay, this. Okay, we're we're gonna put this back. <laughs> 
Did you hear the cat? Did you hear that? There was a cat. Oh my god. Wait, she died in 1947 and they never touched the freaking room? I don't want to go out the window. Oh man. We're gonna have to go out the window, don't we? Okay, okay, we're gonna we're gonna go this, this way. This will be obvious later, but my mom never told me any of these stories. Gee, you know, I would have, why. but mom didn't like bringing up the past. Though, when we adopted a stray kitten, she was the one who named it Molly. That's so many levels of concerning. We go inside. I spent a lot of time in Great Grandma Edie's room. We got along and it was a good place to hide from my mom. Oi. <laughs> Lewis died a week before we left, but Edie had already started to memorialize him. R.I.P. Lewis? Edie knit me a new pair of gloves every year, just in time to replace the old ones. Oh, that's really cute, though. Look at all these cages. Zerpy. Why am I not surprised that they all have dates of death? <laughs> what is with this family being obsessed with death? Built 1937. That's a year... Someone died, I forgot his name, and Molly was born. When Edie told people Sven was killed by a dragon, she could also have said he was building a dragon-shaped slide that collapsed. <laughs> she could have, but... She didn't. This is more fun, to be fair. He was killed by a dragon. If only he was wearing that. Wait, he was building a slide? Dragon kills Finch? This is the thing we saw outside, no? Oh, that's that's unfortunate. <laughs> Alright, there's stuff over here. Let's go explore. The room was like a museum. Yes, it is. Odin! Oh, Odin is the one who died the year Molly was born. For 500 years, the Finches have been famous throughout Norway for their fortune. Uh... And misfortune. I was about to say. Oh, cool, cool, cool. Nice. Odin Finch buries the latest victims of the family curse. His wife, Ingeborg, and their newborn son, Johan. Oh, no. It's always so much sadder when it's kids, somehow. Like, ah, old guy dies. Ah, person dies building a slide. Oh, I should have worn his helmet. Child dies now. Or where's the dog dies? Ugh. You know, it's, it's just very sad. Oh, next. On January 7th, 1937, mm -hmm. he set sail with his family and his house. Cheers. Hoping to leave the curse behind. So that's what they meant when they said the house sank but 40 foot waves off the coast of washington send the house and odin to the bottom of the sea how is that even how did he build a ship that could carry that odin's daughter edie with husband sven and baby molly step ashore on their new home orcas island oh jeez this family is unlucky oh we have the same mug nice Free hugs. <laughs> and then a bunch of cacti. Odin Finch is the first to be buried in the new family cemetery. Yeah, it was the year it was made. What happened to him? His daughter Edie is already dreaming of a new Finch house. Girl, calm down. <laughs> Real news. Okay. That was Odin? Oh, or was it because I pressed the button? Oh. How do we get out of the thing? Okay, just by walking backwards. Got it, thanks. Whatever's wrong with this family, it goes back a long ways. Huh. Are we gonna find out what's wrong with this family? Don't know if I want to. Mysteries of death and thereafter Odin Finch well sounds like he's an expert 
Joining the great majority? What is the great majority? Does he mean like... In terms of death, because out of all the people that have ever been born, like, the great majority has died. So this is a fun way of saying dying. Oh no, it's a novel. Alright. It's okay. You you don't just die. It's not gonna be sad. You're just joining the great majority. Actually sounds kind of comforting. It's no biggie to die. Like, so many people have done it before. <laughs> Even in her 90s. Hi, Zuzu. Sometimes Edie seemed a lot younger than my mother. Oh, happy 90th birthday, Edie. Well, Edie lived to be old with this curse, man. Oh. My. God, I love The Edie. only trace <laughs> Grandpa Sam's first wife, Kay, left on the house was okay. the pink bathroom. I freaking adore Kay. Jesus Christ. It was Christ. a pretty big trace. It is a very big trace. My God. Even the toilets. <laughs> what? Oh my lord. <laughs> There's a frog. You are absolutely adorable. Okay. Ducks! They have ducks and tiny people. Okay, okay. We're just we're just gonna <laughs> We're gonna go read a diary. There is a secret in his bathroom. How do we have the key to everything? <gasps> Maybe this is another Oh my god, is this another one of those secrets? There's a secret in this bathroom. Uh, it's a different kind of secret from what I thought. It's a very pink bathroom as well. It's in the last place you would look. Is it in the toilet? It isn't in the cupboard. It's hidden in this book. Oh my god, this is so cute! <laughs> Who built all of this? She asks no questions, she just goes, she's like, okay, guess that's the next part. Let's go. Oh, jeez. Encanto who? Sven gave Sam an old camera he'd refurbished. He uh -huh. never put it down. Aw. Oh. Those are interesting photos. <laughs> this is the first selfie. Wow. Okay. Do we go underneath here? But, uh, uh, Milton? Milton? This is why Milton had to die. He knew too much. He knew all the secrets. They're like, he's a liability. Gotta tie up the loose ends, man. Milton. This is really cute. Milton was an artist. Milton was 11. Milton made that. Secret tunnel, secret tunnel, into Milton's room, question mark. Yeet. Oh wait, this is the divided room. Is it Sam and Fort Calvin? What is with the sound? I don't like the music. Oh, it's turning wholesome again, Jesus. Hi, Jesse. Y yeah. Astronaut, scientist, person, and child soldier. Sure. I knew Grandpa Sam had a twin. Oh my god. To the command center. This is so cute. Oh wow. Look at that. Jesse, hold on. Jesse, welcome back to the sub squad. 48th month in a row. Jesse, that is special. Uh. All right, we're gonna have to go through here now. Okay. Yes. And that he never talked about him. Oh. It's okay. Calvin dreamt of being an astronaut, but now he's with the stars. I guess my grandpa didn't like history any more than my mom did. Oh God. Why is there like a note in there? How I want to remember my brother by Sam Finch. The thing I remember is that when he made up his mind, oh. that was it. We have a foot in the cast. And a band-aid. Oh, uh, My brother said Wallace? he'd die before he ate another mushroom. And he did. <sighs> oh. At Barbara's funeral, we swore we'd never be afraid again. And he wasn't. 
I think Calvin always wanted to fly. That's what we're going to. Is this how he dies? Please tell me this isn't how he dies. Stop! Calvin! Dino's ready! Coming! Oh, but no. that day, he finally made up his mind to do it. I told him going around was impossible. No, it's not, but not a great idea. Maybe if You're I hadn't like, said fall. that. You need different kind of chains, man. You're gonna like fall. Oh no, I don't like this. Maybe if the wind hadn't picked up. Bro. Then maybe he'd still be here. That's but not I doubt it. physically possible, but still. Jesus Christ, does this kid I have a death wish? I think he'd already wish? made up his mind. That's what I want to remember about my brother. Jesus Christ, it's gonna wind up though. You're gonna get shorter and shorter. Like, what? The day he made up his mind to fly. And he did. Ayo? Calvin's story felt strangely familiar. When I was younger, I remember was trying 11. to do the exact same thing. Girl, she got lucky. Calvin was also 11. What is it with 11 year olds in his family? Jesus Christ. Molly was 10. Milton was 11. Calvin was 11. I, I'm concerned. <laughs> he straight up launched himself. Okay, Calvin. Mr. Command Center. How rich After were the these funeral, people? Edie rubbed off Calvin's half of the room. Wow. Mom said Grandpa Sam enlisted at 18 and never set foot in the room again. He lived here for another seven years. Looking at his twin, his dead twin's half of their room. Oh my god. Is that alcohol? <laughs> um, it's a cool hat. Jesus Christ. Imagine taking home a girl and trying to take her to your room and then never mind. Where, where do we go? Can I can I leave now? Let me out. Hello, I want to go. Uh, oh. Oh, that's really cute. What hell? I... Ah. <gasps> it's a butterfly. Who cut the butterfly in half? Did you have to? Okay. There we go. Higher up, higher up. Jesus Christ. Who made all of this? Why is there a pumpkin? Why is it Halloween? The passages were a pretty tight fit. You think? They'd obviously been built for smaller hands and bellies. What is this? Never mind, never mind, never mind. We go this way. That is creepy as heck. We go this way. Thank you. Open up, please. Um. Mm hmm? We can go back in a second. Oh, it's a wine cabinet? Edie's father, Odin, built the original house. Thanks, Odin. Oh, we're gonna have to go back. <laughs> oh, not Gorilla Man. Milton! Milton knew all the secrets! I called it! Milton had to go. They had to go. He knew too much. Barbara. Growing up, I always thought of Barbara as a child star. But? That's enough to give a child trauma. Uh, okay, dreadful stories. Barbara, she was 16. Aww. Of all the stories people Barbara wrote about Finch. Barbara's death, I'm surprised Edie saved this one. They wrote stories about her death?
old Jack old here. Jack oh. here with Voice acting. Ghastly tale inspired by America's most unfortunate family. Wow. I'm calling this is rude. It the surprise ending of Barbara Finch. I like how they have uh, advertisements on the other side. Star, Barbara was famous for her scream. <whistles> now at 16, she was all washed up. Washed up? Bro, she but was more than you would ever be. Break, Shut up. She'd been asked to perform her signature scream at a local convention for monster movie fans. <laughs> it keeps them buying scream for us. Her career needed. Okay. Unfortunately, her scream hadn't aged well. <gasps> mm, getting better. <laughs> I think you just need the right motivation. Scream coach. Her oh no. Fan, and current boyfriend, Rick, oh, no. was about to demonstrate when... Ah! He's like, yeah, like that, exactly. Now That's that what we need. was a great scream. It He's not even Barbara's face. It was father, Sven. He'd slipped into a table saw and had to be rushed to the emergency room. It was a great so scream, though. Barbara got stuck babysitting her youngest brother, Walter. Her convention comeback was cancelled. <laughs> what? <laughs> Now, that was okay, a good scream. I'm hearing frustration, but I'm not hearing terror. What if I tried... A gang of hoodlums in Halloween masks have been terrorizing Orca's Island tonight. Police are urging residents to... A gang of hoodlums in the basement? What? You're right. Also, I loved your delivery on that. Why is your basement door locked? Why is because he insufferable? Because making puzzles in secret passages. Leave the There's door locked. There's a key hidden in the music box. No, no, no. Is the there... secret is to keep winding... And winding. There's potential until burglaries. Finally, the key pops out. Thanks, babe. Oh. I'll be back in a sec. Oh, now we know. Twenty minutes later, Rick hadn't returned. I don't care. We locked the door so again. Barbara he can knock. Went to look for him. You don't right go look for him. He's not worth it. She's gonna deliver a scream of a lifetime. She reached for the music box. Did she put the key back? And as she wound the key, she this listened way. for Rick, but the house oh, was silent. Why would you go there? No boy is worth it. I choose the bear, man. We have to walk. Oh no. What if it's him, like, making this up to get her scared? She found Rick's crutch and, and blood? imagined the worst. It's a weapon. It's a weapon now. Why is there a bloody handprint? I swear if he's just setting this up to get us to scream better. What? What is this? The gang's leader is the infamous Hookman Killer, Dr. Carl Hamill, who impaled and then ate his family ten years ago tonight. I'm turning around. I'm turning around. Goodbye. <laughs> Goodbye. Why would you... Oh my god. This is so creepy. Oh, we can hit things. Oh, huh. I'm hitting everything, I don't care. Oh, it's so dark. F for flashlight? Nope. How big is this basement? Why is there the winding go- The fridge rattled and grew stale. The fridge? What's in the fridge? Okay, okay, we're gonna hit the thing. Oh, we're gonna, oh, oh dear! Huh, oh dear! He's like, no, you were supposed to. Oh. Rick. Barb. He's like, you relax. were supposed to scream. I was just trying to scare you to help you find your scream. Well, I'm not scared, Rick. I'm furious. <sighs> then act furious. All I'm getting from you now is that you're hurt and confused and you. He can leave, thank she you. She threw him out. But she kept a little something to remember him by. <laughs> His crutch. Barb, have you seen my other crutch? And she was no. still holding it when she fell asleep watching the late, late picture show. Hours later. Where is this Barbara? going? Walter, what's going on up there? Ah! Oh, right, we were babysitting. Okay, I'm coming up. Ah! This is a trick. Uh, fine, I'm coming up. <laughs> what? Oh, 
Sorry. Why is your skeleton there? Is this Halloween? I ain't taking no chances. I ain't taking no chances, man. Hydration, we shall hydrate. Before our death. Hello? Uh, who's responsible for that? W Walter? Walter, hon, are you here? Walter? Walter, are you there? Hey, what's up, Walter? Bro, I will hit you. Walter, he vanished. But his red sand radio was still on. Wh where did he go? Orcas Island Wh police described the man as six feet tall, with a steel hook for a hand. Residents are urged Still to lock all doors and windows and notify the police of any suspicious activity. Barb returned, saw uh, the hook man, and... Knock up Captain Hook! ...was speechless. She still he didn't scream. smashing. <laughs> okay. What? Lock the door. He was. He couldn't get enough. Where the heck is Walter? Okay, Barbara. There's okay, gotta be you can be a murderer, but you don't have to be a freak about it. Jesus, there's gotta be another way out of here. Okay, we'll we'll uh, okay, we'll go here. Walter, why'd you leave me, Walter? Jo oh, okay. She played her part beautifully. She was seventeen. Leave this poor child alone. Are we gonna hit him from behind? Molly. Beat him up, beat him up, beat him up! Oh, oh, are we supposed to sneak past him? Or are we supposed to? Oh, there we go. <laughs> he wasn't moving, but she sensed the story might not be over yet. Did we just murder someone? Okay. Um, how about we just uh, hit him again? Maybe not. Like, I mean, it's okay. We can toss him a crutch. It'll be fine. Do we? Do we go to him? Do we go to him? Do we dare? He's gonna be gone, the isn't he? The man had vanished. She listened for his breathing, but all she heard was. <laughs> How do you know what she heard? She died. Oh, why is she gonna open it? Is she dumb? Why would you go and open the door? Didn't they say it was a gang? Self-defense indeed, Andy. Someone at the door was dying to speak to young Barbara. Someone at the door can piss off. What? Who is it? Hello? I don't want to talk about my car's extended warranty. At the door, she heard whisper. Is coming from inside the house. We're going outside. We're going out. We're going out. <laughs> oh dear. Oh dear. FBI, open up. Cece. Surprise! Bravo, <laughs> You were wonderful. The monsters had come to surprise her. For Barbara, it was a dream come true. Wait, hold on. What? And she saw what kind of monsters they were, and she realized what was about to happen. Uh, she was going to be famous. And with her final breath, Barbara Finch gave the performance of her life. Oh, she's finally gonna scream. I wasn't there myself. Oh, weren't you? I hear Barbara was magnificent. What were these Poor people Barbara. on? She had a taste for stardom. This but is so disrespectful to her family. So Someone her wrote fans. this comic. Of course, the police blamed it all on poor Rick, who disappeared the same night. And little Walter? Hiding under his bed the whole time. He took it all pretty hard. But that's another story. 
As for what? Barbara, tucked inside the music box is all they ever found of her. Her ear. Her ear? Now that's what I call a real eerie tale. Stop! <laughs> No, that was... Oh my god, you get arrested by the pun police. What the heck? Ah! Oh no, we're gonna have to go back to the... Oh. Edie told me all Barbara wanted was to be remembered. As absurd as that comic was. Maybe what Edie saw was a happy ending. Who wrote that? Jesus Christ. I am so confused. Next. <laughs> what? We need to go back through here, I guess. Off to the music box we go. I guess now I know why mom doesn't like me playing with the music box. Yeah. Did they genuinely find her ear in a music box or did they make that up? Oh my god, this- this- this entire house is messed up. This entire house is just weird. Wait, was the music box up or downstairs? Forgot. Could be upstairs, actually. Oh no, it's here, it's here. Oh, right next to the basement. Convenient. Can I please? There we go. We just, uh, spin and spin and keep spinning and spinning and spinning and spinning. Oh, we have the key! Okay! Okay, I know Lily, it's weird. But they keep the box because they made it themselves, right? Did Sven make it himself? Uh, this is so weird. Oh, with the creepy music still in the back. I mean, we've just been here, but it's uh, considerably less creepy. How did they know what her basement looks like in the comic? Mom said the basement was off limits. Unless I wanted another tetanus shot. Well, fair enough. Oh, definitely fair enough. You don't want kids running around here. I saw Edie sneak down to the basement once, carrying oh. packages. Packages? What kind of packages? How did I they maybe know she was hiding presents? How did they know there was a fridge in the basement? The comic is scaring me now. It turned out she was hiding a lot more than that. Oh. Hello. Click it. So <laughs> What's in his basement? Oh no. I remember asking Secret mom once about where Walter had gone. Secret tunnel. She said after Barbara died, he got as far away as he could. Underneath the house. If there's a pattern in all these stories. Tasty. Why is there so much food? Were they prepping for doomsday? I think it's that none of us has gotten very far. Walter. Oh my god. Well, R.I.P. literally everyone. Oh, more writing. Goodbye, everyone. I can't believe I've been down here for 30 years. What? On that first day, after the shaking started, I didn't think I'd survive a week. He's been living in his bunker for 30 years? Why? But after a few days, I settled into a routine. Did he That's what kept me sane. It was fallout? What? Was he locked in here? What happened? Having what? a schedule. Living for today. Was he paranoid? I always expected to be dead tomorrow. Who eats the peaches like this? But if you wait long enough, you get used to anything. If you wait long enough, it's gonna be tomorrow eventually. Put it somewhere else. If it keeps falling, just put the little thingy somewhere else. Even a monster on the other side of the door starts to feel normal. Almost friendly. Uh-huh. Sure, buddy. How many peaches you got? And then one day, everything just... Swerf is gonna fall again. Just Stop. catch it. Just catch... Oh. 
Whatever that thing was, it was gone. Okay. Maybe it got tired of waiting. Are you Or maybe I just got tired of being afraid. Was it all metaphorical monsters? Peaches, 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 peaches. It's been a week now. The longest in 30 years. I'm done waiting. I have okay. to leave. Well, I still can. Supposed to 30 years ago. Where are we going? Why am I pressing the forward button, which is usually the up button, to go down? This is so counterintuitive. Who made this? This was a floating house before. I know it's out there, somewhere. Okay. Sure. Whatever killed Barbara. Is he scared of the monsters that killed Barbara? Is that why? Molly. And Calvin. <laughs> Maybe this oh, is, is all a mistake. Okay. Okay, we're breaking. But I need to stop living the same day. Even if it kills me. Break down the walls. At least we got a sledgehammer if monsters attack. Whatever's out there, I want you to know I'm ready for it. Are you, though? I'm going to appreciate all of it, especially the food. And then he's just going to get hit by a falling boulder the moment he steps out. I don't out. mind what if I bet. only have a year left. Or a month. It's been 30 years in there. Or Jesus. a single week. Indeed, Ink, this is why we talk I'd to be therapists. Happy with one new day. Oh, I can so already imagine beautiful. the sun on my face. Ooh it was not a falling boulder, but I was not far off. I called it. Walter. Walter died beautiful. when I was six. I can't believe my mom never told me he was down here. What? Was he down here and everyone knew? Or did he just kind of sneak off and he was like, goodbye? Like kind of a Bruno situation. We don't talk about Bruno. Apparently we don't talk about Walter either. And then one day he wanders out after using a sledgehammer to break through. Why was there a train so close to their house? I'm, I have so many questions. Oh my god, Walter. My god. Oh, another part a portrait Edie made. I'm sure my mom was trying to protect me. Well, your mom did a shit job, didn't she? Oh, why are we going through? <sighs> Grab the thing. Thank you. Your mom was not very good at protecting. <sighs> you think Edie knew but no one else? Can I just go down? Thank you. This is interesting. Maybe she was afraid I'd end up like Walter. At least. But if she never he told me about an while. uncle under the house, <laughs> what I can else only imagine there? what she else didn't... she was hiding. An uncle under the house. I don't want to make this the same trash. mistakes she made. Oh God! Oh, we're getting out of here. Nope, nope. We're getting out of here. Trying to bury something that's still alive. How is your train tracks this close? Did she not learn anything from her uncle? Now that there's only one of us left. Or maybe two. Girl, I there's about to be none left. The stories for myself. Careful. And found out what happened to everyone else. Yeah. But now I'm worried the stories themselves might be the problem. Okay. Maybe we believed so much in a family curse. We made it real. Aw, Walter. True, it's the self-fulfilling prophecy. The shaking was just a train passing by. Oh my god. Wait, where did the train even go? Why was there a train here? Why was it this close to their freaking house? Where was the... 
we could just like numb on the flowers that, that would end your suffering real fast you know like two or three of these would help i don't know if i should even be writing this It seems like most of them die with things associated to their interests slash hobbies. Just don't be interested Maybe in Maybe it'd anything. be better if all this just died with me. Yeah. Uh, uh, the, okay. That just turned on. Is there like but a I thought you should know about or? your family. Yeah. Ooh. Uh, they're freaking me out. <laughs> and the history you're a part of. This is the thing that was in the basement. How did the people who made the... Uh, how did they know this was in the basement? The, the comic? How did the comic know? Are we gonna go there? Are we gonna walk into the water? What is over there? Ayo, there's like fire over there. I wanna see that. Fine, we'll go, we'll go to the other thing. There. Ooh. This is weird. Though, to be honest, I feel as lost as you probably do right now. Okay. <gasps> Sunny, what? Wait, MC is writing and we have written accounts from all of the dead relatives? She dies at the end, doesn't she? Sunny, stop! No, but that would make so much sense. I think the people in these stories believed them. For what that's worth. No, Edith. What if we're actually Edith's child reading this right now? Like, living her story the way we were- we are living everyone else's stories. My god. That's and so deep. You look at the house. Such a twist. That history of imagination and stubbornness and madness. Any of it seems possible. Please open. Thank you. Jesus Christ. And just like that, we're back. Oh my gosh, the bike. I think we've been surrounded by death for so long, we've just gotten used to it. Technically, everyone gets surrounded by death. But this is very much very traumatic. What death. kind of family finishes building a cemetery before starting the house? Yeah, that's 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 tragic. Go here, I guess. It's embarrassing we... for me to admit this. On but our way to the cemetery? The pet cemetery made me more uncomfortable than the human one. Oh, I've read enough about pet cemetery. Three of the gerbils were mine, and two had been my fault. Oh, your fault? Oh, God. You have Derpy and Derpy Jr. <laughs> Burpy? Chirpy, Flirpy, Alerpy, and Zerpy. And then Zoe, Coco, Tucker, Charlie, Daisy, and Lucy. I feel like they were the owls, probably. These were the gerbils. Uh... Oh, this is pretty. Sven built the house, but it was Edie who designed the cemetery. Oh, oh, oh my god. I didn't realize this was the cemetery. Molly. With the cat. December 11th to December 13th. She was barely 10. Oh my god. Calvin. With the rock. This is surprisingly beautiful. Oh my god. Sven Finch. Edie. Okay, I, I have no idea how to guess her. Did she design her own? tombstone before she died wait but the little girl knew she was about to die right how did she actually die because all of these are like haha monsters not really it just ended with there's a monster under my bed <sighs> Jesus Walter what is this Like an eye. It's just a piece of cheese. He would he would have wanted the yeah. She probably died from poisoning from the stuff she ate. I don't. 
Is it the train? Is this a train? It doesn't look like a train, does it? Barbara. Little star. Oh, Barbara. Oh, person. I'm sure Odin's oh, it's monument tunnel. had been Edie's idea. Fair enough. My mom was always trying to move on. But for Edie, the past never went away. Oh, no shit. At first, I thought she had an extra arm, but it was... <laughs> She could see it poking out of the water at low tide. What is it? Oh, I want to know. Is this the next one? Edie said she dreamed about the old house every night. Oh, this is the house that sank. It was sl it was vaguely triangular and it had a hole. It was like it's cheese. He wanted cheese, you know. Oh, fine. oh my god! Well, well, that's so pretty. Can we look at that? Can we can we look again? Can we look at that instead? <laughs> I think the answer is no. All right. Edie's side was always easier for me to understand. Mm. Well, for me too, a little bit. But the older I get, the more I can see where my mom was coming from. Her dad had been pretty strict, but it wasn't enough to save her brothers. She was just trying to do better. Aww. Gregory, Sam, and Gus. What do you have? Why do you not have anything? Where's your thing, Gregory? Everyone gets a thing. That's the thing of this family. Things. Sam has a flag. Go, Merka. He was only 33. He was 11. Gregory was 11. Sam was 33. Gus was... Oh my god. Why are they all so young? He was only 13. Are they actually buried here as well? Why is this cemetery she lost like two of her an brothers, attraction? Just like I did. I get why she tried so hard to protect us. Milton. Why is there no date of. Because he just disappeared. There's no death. We never found Milton's body, so my mom insisted we were putting up a monument, not a tombstone. What happened to Milton? I, I can't deal with this. I need answers. Sanjay Kumar. Right, he was a little bit older. 30 minus 2. We put, uh, 4 is 34. Wait, is it a 2 or... Yeah, 34. 36. Oh, Lewis. I can't really read that. 88 to 10 plus 12 is tw uh, 23. They're all so young. Oh my god. There's so many things I wish I could ask my mom now. Part of me thinks this is what she wanted all along. For me to come back someday. I was going to say death? And find everything out for myself. How is this better? How is this better? Wait, Sanjay was her dad. Did he- he married into the family. Did he marry into bad luck? Oof, sorry buddy. But looking back on it now... You just read the spoilers? Lady Lover now! <laughs> oh my god. So as you played it, you've loved it. So glad to see it being played again. Oh my god. Don't know if I like this. Don't know if I like this anymore. If she told me there was going to be so much climbing, <laughs> I never would have come when I was 22 weeks pregnant. Ooh! She's pregnant? She squeezed through all those tiny little things with a belly and, and a baby in that belly. What are we doing? This is highly irresponsible. You have a track record of falling out of trees and just dying and just keating. Why are you? Jesus Christ! Mm. 
my god! My god! Highly responsible, no, uh, no wonder so many of them are dead. Exactly. What are we doing? Why are you on the roof? I thought you were like a child still. Oh, there's there's a letter there. Hold on. I'm on the wrong side of history. <laughs> um, Jesus Christ. I never met Grandpa Sam, but I think he and my mom had a lot in common. Okay. Look at the Barbie. Okay. Come on. Open up. Let's get inside. They were both pretty intense. Bear. Okay, we're safe. We're inside. Whew. Deep breath. Deep breath. Oh, next person. Sam. Another one of Edie's paintings. Oh, and a ring. Alright, Sam, let's go. Let's read about your tragic death, I guess. Try not to think about- Dad! Oh! <gasps> Someone tear the freaking house down! I cannot! 